Hello everybody, I want to show you this video a quick review of the Samsung Galaxy M11. So let's have a look first what's included. Uh, of course next to the phone we have a charging cable or data cable um, with a USB Type-C um, plug-in. So very important if you want to buy a second one. And uh, yeah, with a power charging adapter which one supports fast charging by the way. A pin to remove the SIM tray and uh, which one is here on the side and I will show you later. And also some instruction manuals. Yeah, this Android 10 smartphone have a 6.4 inch display uh, which one have a full HD plus so what is not so great anymore but it's absolutely okay for a budget smartphone and especially for a small display size. So at the back we have a plastic cover which one is very resistant against uh, scratches by the way so I've used it now for several days but no scratches and yeah the colors uh, you can have uh, black, blue or violet so I feel the black version and uh, what is nice to know is that the front will be always black but just the sides and the back will have a different color. So then we have here also the fingerprint sensor to unlock the phone at the back and the triple cam. So then we have Octa-Core CPU here in that phone with 8 times 1.8 gigahertz. The CPU is from 2017 uh, but it's uh, still fast enough for a budget phone. So what about the storage? So we have 64 gigabytes and 4 gigabytes of RAM. So if you want to extend the storage, you can use a micro SD card up to 256 gigabytes. Yeah, what is very nice on the phone, you can insert two SIM cards and a micro SD card uh, to extend the internal storage. Yeah, what about the camera? As I said, we have a triple cam here uh, with the main cam of 30 MPs, uh, which one supports HDR and makes full HD videos. And then we have a 5MP ultra wide cam. I will show you uh, also uh, what does it mean. And a 2 megapixel depth cam. And at the front, we have an 8MP cam here in that notch, which one supports also full HD videos. So let me show you now uh, what I meant with the cameras. So with the ultra wide camera and so on. Because if you're very close to an object, uh, maybe like me now, or if you want to make a group picture, it's also very close to the group, then you can just tap here on the ultra wide cam. And now you have much more on the screen. Uh, but please mind that the outdoor white cam have just 5 MPs and the main cam have 13 MPs. Now what is also very nice to know, the phone supports 4G, it has Wi-Fi of course, Bluetooth, it has no NFC, please mind it has no NFC and uh, yeah, but as well is very nice, it has a bit in FM radio, but you can just use it with a headset. And as we have seen, there's no headset included. So if you buy a separate headset, you can use also the integrated FM radio. Then with the connections here, we have a USB type C plug in here. So if you need the second cable, so please take care that you buy USB type C. And what is very nice, we have an extra audio jack here, uh, audio jack plug in because um, at some new phones you would need an adapter for to use uh, the regular uh, audio jack headsets. So then we have here a 5000 mAh battery which one is non-removable. Uh, so a nice battery for that price because uh, you can use it uh, almost for two days. And um, this battery supports also fast charging. So if you have less time to charge your phone you could have also a lot of energy inside. Yeah, what about the price? I've told you already, it is a budget smartphone and you can have it just for 130 euro and may this price is going down also in the future. So uh, you can do nothing wrong with, so you can take it. So let me show you also what you can do with the phone. Of course, we can do screenshots here with the phone. So if you see something nice, you can uh, capture it. Then you can also edit it directly after me if you a screenshot a website or something like this and you just want to have the picture from there you can do that you can just crop it and save it to your gallery or save uh, or share it directly maybe uh, with whatsapp or something like this so then you have some other basic features like uh, torch here uh, what is very nice um, to have it included so you can change as well here the brightness and so on if you want and uh, yeah what is very very nice is the blue light filter because um, now if we enable it, you can see the phone is changing into a different color. And um, so uh, if you're using your smartphone, it gives a lot of stress to your eyes. And uh, with that blue light filter, you can reduce the stress uh, for your eyes. And uh, if you're using your smartphone at night, may you have problems right now to sleep in. Um, so and with this option here, you have better chances to sleep well. 
Yeah, thank you so, so much for watching this video. I hope I could help you with it. And uh, yeah, if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me some up. Uh, that would be really helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for. And yeah, I've created also some other videos if you're interested in or may just subscribe me. It would be really a pleasure to see you again. And yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.